sorry. I'm sorry. chat. I hope we all are doing a fantastic. Everyone had a great Christmas. This is very loud. There we go. I'm gonna turn down the de desktop audio to like 15 and we're gonna go from there. I have no idea how to preview my live stream without the desktop audio coming through, which is fantastic. Last stream's audio was really scuffed. Back on the 22nd. It was super scuffed. Ugh. Because, one, sounded very echoey. Two, my voice was drowned out from the music. And three, it was, it was dog's poo poo. I was taking, last night I was editing some highlights um, for YouTube shorts, by the way. Video, YouTube, sh a short coming out later. Hey, Quiv. Glad to see you, man. Enjoy your Christmas. <clears throat> Anyways, as I was editing my stream, I realized that, uh, what call it? It was it was very scuffed. And I was like, I can't even use any of all that footage to make a highlight. Um, but last night I'm I'm starting to get the hang of like making these highlights. I'm only like my only like my second highlight. Um and so whatchamacallit. Uh I realized I'm glad it's over a lull and no more Christmas. Hey man, we still got we still got the New Year's. I was editing my I was editing the stream, just going through it, playbacking, and um, and I've lost my train of thought. Fuck. <laughs> Five minutes into the stream and I'm already swearing. Woohoo! Uh -huh. Today, as for what we are doing, today we are going to be working on what you might call it. We're going to be hacking away at the, the EM grid. Because last time, so what we're trying to do is that we're just trying to make a temporary measure to block characters in. 
and make sure that they're not able to navigate to places and like triggering certain parts on the map to oh, let me just let me just show you home base first mission from home base so we're trying to make these guys Get block. We're trying. What, what's happening here is that we are trying to make them. When the players enter this sphere over here, right, right around here, the radius of the sphere here. Let me just pull it out. There it is. When the characters move here, these go. Let's see. The thing is, is that. Hell's going on with the sounds. My gosh. Anyways, <clears throat> excuse me. You see that these grids are these like squi these squares, these tiles on the map are still occupied, and so, uh, so yeah. Now what we got to do is one. I need to go into my OBS. And I need to look over at it. gonna look at my OBS because I love this encoder issue with my computer. I need to figure out like what the hell Unreal uses for displaying its uh, stuff like this. So we're gonna save this. Unoccupy them squares. Exactly. That is exactly what I'm trying to do. So what I have here is if I go to blueprints and I go to test pot flag location, open up this blueprint actor. First we're gonna we're gonna change this. Sphere. We're gonna change the element to green. Give me green. I want green. No. I just want to make a color. I want to make a color. Basic shape material. No. Ugh, fine. I'll make it a coop. A coop. Just to make up my life easier. And then... Okay. Cube is there. Hello, cube. Yep. So, anyways. Event graph. So, right now... So what this is doing is that when this when the sphere overlaps actors then if it's true get all actors all actors of class for each loop get an actor of class do once and then delay. This is currently a temporary solution for the the revealing of like enemy pods in the game. So like if you like go to a certain spot on the map, it's like, oh hey, enemies! Look at that. Uh, or you know what I could do? I could as to the EM grid, and then I can just like be like, okay, uh, spawn these, spawn an enemy. Let me see if there's any function. Level. Get level.
it's an asset. Okay, what we need. Oh, I gotta look. Let's spawn in an actor. Okay. Should do the trick. So if true, I went to spawn it. This could do it, honestly. And then get actor of class, EM grid, instructed object, and then hold on, hold on, wait a minute. Okay, spawning actors, there you are. Oh my god, new wallpaper truck? Yeah. It's a cat. It's him. It is him. Is he indeed? Let's see. Good use of wallpaper engine. Got it. I gotta change mine. Far too long, it's been Minecraft Redstone Clock. Oh, that's interesting. Excuse me. Also, how is the music? Is it loud? Too loud? Yeah, 
Yes, I would like to reopen that. Thank you. I'm a bit quiet today. Okay. Let me, uh, let me, uh, try to change things up and then do that. And then, volume. Let's see. Well, fire effects. There you go. What happens if I try to go over here? Oh my gosh. Out of memory for skin cash? Alright, stop. Spawning minions. Do once. Just do once. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna do a quick spawn and then if branch true. Make a quick in here. Uh, testing, testing spawn on. Is that true? Oh wait, no, it's gonna really fuck up. If the condition is that, then we go into false. Okay. Just one more. See Daisy, I forgot to do this. That did me. Okay. What the hell? Oh my gosh, it is spawning so many. Okay. Uh, 
<laughs> Wait, let's take a look. Okay, I see. I see. St all these static meshes, great, cool. Need. Probably right here. Oh, oh my gosh! Look at how many actors it's spawning. Holy shit! <laughs> my logic is fucked up. Okay. Draw a debug sphere if that is true. Is it now, Quiv? Is it better? I hope it's better. whenever I'm targeting. Well, if I hit this button, it at... Yeah, why? Can I, and like, okay, and then if I can go like right there. Yeah. The game doesn't crash. Okay. All right, time to find some code. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Battle controller. Get battle game mode. As battle game mode, spawn actor. Hmm. Input component. K. 
cast to em EM battle game mode. Okay. Let's get this figured out! Uh, and then we go to spawn. Uh, this is a CPP file. I need the header file. Spawn. What do you mean? Oh. And then. Uh, these files is. Blueprint callable. Yeah. Okay. do that because that's just gonna fuck it up let's just do some live coding see if that will do anything which probably won't Anything interesting happen for during the holidays, chat? I'll go first while I, I, <laughs> ooh, I got a Tyranid army. So I've got a bunch of Gants. I got four squads of Gants, two um, Winged Primes, Psychophages, a Tyranifex. And then Barbagants at the Wazoo, Von Ryan's, and then I got a box of Venom Thropes, which I converted into a Zoanthrope, and then a I forgot the name of this this unit, but I got a lot of miniatures. I also got that. Okay, cool. All right, that's good. Cast a battle game mode. Spawn. And spawn back. Okay, we're good. We get you. All right. Uh, I got a USB hub and a body pillow. <laughs> With nothing on it, luckily. Okay, good. No waifus. All right, that's fair. That is fair. No waifus. But who are you thinking of getting on? Getting it on? The who are you thinking of getting? sleeping on a side. What the fuck? Oh my gosh. Oh, I gotta set up a new variable. I had to re That makes sense.
If I had to choose which waifu to put on a body pillow. Be very careful about your 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 response here, dude. Unless you be judged hard by me. I'd have to be Toro Hagakuri from My Hero Academia. It will pass. It shall pass. Uh, set and then I haven't seen the show by the way why did you just crash like that I haven't seen the show either I just know what she looks like maybe Images. <laughs> okay, fair. Not bad. Not bad. Save that file, and then we are going to get into... We are going to go into this, and then we are going to try to compile, and let, let's hope we don't crash! Well, let's hope our build succeeds. Building six actions with four processes. We're going to go back to the old method. Please. 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 Bruh. Why the fuck is that? What? Okay, chat. What's going? Chat. What's going on here is that I'm trying to get trying to compile this so that I can get this grit this at uh, this uh function into the game, the remove actor. So okay, and so this is saying. No, no user, oh wait, error, that's just a note, error, void, remove actor, cannot, const, IEM, grid actor, pointer, cannot convert argument one from T script interface, IEM, grid actor, to IEM, constant, IEM, grid actor, what the fuck is a T script in interface, oh my gosh, Warning, C4701. This is the warning. Who cares about warnings? Am I right, chat? Who cares about warnings? <laughs> warnings. More like shmornings. Uh, 
I really got him, chat. Some internal generic class, I guess. Yeah. Some internal generic class indeed. Let's see about this. All right, let's look at this chat. Let us look at this. That's my Discord. Tease. Script interface. I've already. What's what's the specific error? Signing. I have the property U property replicated T script where the interface. However, I, if I then want to, I then get, cannot, basically you want to do this. My actor dot get class implements interface U interface static class. Yes, this later on. Okay. Okay, that's one solution. Let's just make sure. Check out this, and then oh, da, da. I've been using the T script interface, so I can get interface reference as a U property. If I can't assign null without first type casting to the known. Let's look up. Let's look up this. Okay. T script. Nope. Do not modify that at all. At all. No news. This isn't very fun. Uh, let's ch keep checking this out. T script remove actor. So fucking annoying. If you enjoy my suffering, please make sure to like and subscribe. I think I might be missing something as I cast. Interface as I currently have tried both T script item cast I loot. Okay. Get up to here. Uh, I'll come back later. Got to do some things at home. BRB. All right. See you a bit later. Thanks. Oh, 
Accessors and operators for referencing module core U object include template class interface type class T script interface public F script interface default constructor script interface. That's in it, chat. That's in it, chiefs. I can't fucking find anything. What the hell, dude? Then, like, if I remove, like, my... My remove actor... And I compile again, dude? It then compiles just fine. Like, hold on. It's compiling. Manual compile. Da 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 That's working. Oh, uh, man. Man, oh, man. Branch that. If that is true, do nothing. If false, do that. And then spawn actor, spawn enemies. And then boom, 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 boom. Save my stuff, make writable. Game fucking crashes. Great. Ugh! Great. Well, oh, this is genuinely frustrating, chat.
Okay. You know what? I need to consult the programmer on this. And the grid needs love. It needs a lot of love. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna work on something else that is fundamentally integrated into our code, not in our blueprints. It's a blueprinter. Okay. All right, so we're gonna be working on the controller. So chat, what we're gonna be doing is now we're gonna be working on the controller. As you can see here, if we play this, and if you look at the top, the top right here, we see this little initiative thing. Yeah, that's because it goes into the game mode BP, the BP battle game mode. And in the battle game mode, it then, re so it does all this bullshit. Um, this is rolling for an initiative right now. It's completely random. And then it reads this initiative EM character object array. And then prints the string, creates an, an initiative widget. See, the thing is, is that we need to make it a brand new function. And that function. So now we have the, we have the array. We have initiative initiative I gotta write this out so what, what I want to specifically do with this initiative right now is that I want to I want to today what I want to do instead is that I want to want the I want first what I want to do is that I want to just flip flop between controls. So like right now, once the character has done all of its moves, it's zero. If AP is zero, then it goes to the next one. So right now, what we're gonna do is that we're gonna check first for if character, if character, has has zero AP. Just gonna do a simple print. So Custom event. So then, if my character, if the in the event that my character ends their turn, character has zero, zero AP. get a self-reference and then from there if that character Should not fire right now, because uh, I'm not having anything. Okay, let's just move him. Yeah. Okay. 
actually. Oh, oh, we don't have any fucking documentation for Battle Game and the characters. Fucking hell. Oh my gosh. Uh, I don't. We don't have any documentation. It's kind of fruitless to work on the controller and all of that. Because see, the thing is, is that I'd just kind of be fumbling in the dark. Like, deadass, we have zero documentation on this project. Uh, and like, what if there's already a check for a character has zero AP? I'm sure there is. I'm like, if the character has zero AP, then you can't select the character anymore. Yeah, there's some function. chat oh dear oh dear chat you know what i'm gonna uh this is gonna be really boring i think this is gonna be a boring stream today oh this is so annoying this is going to be me working on documentation like this is un genuinely unsettling it's making me pissed working on doc project doc I know, I'm jumping from one thing to another, but this is, I need something. Battle game of one of the steps in initializing. Okay, that's that, that that's fine right now. Um, and then we're just gonna do title two EM battle. Game mode functions. And then, I'm sorry. Like, I. Fuck. You're gonna see me write this. Then this. Game architecture. Begin play. Okay. So, okay, we have tick, we have instance. You know what I'm just gonna do on ins instance, slow down, time, interp. Parameters, delta time. This, this function tells tells the camera to slow down when it when a condition slow down and move to above the BP player 
character while slowing down the game. Okay. Okay, and then title four. Interp. Time dilation. Oh my goodness. Oh man, oh man, chat. I am sorry. This this is Oh man. But I do wanna ask. Chat, do we have any New Year's resolutions or anything of that matter? I got a couple of my own. Oh, that feels good. Oh, that feels so good. Oh, that feels so good. That's not fun for you, chat. It's necessary for me, but I can't work on that shit. So, let's just do some well to that. Too big. Like that. Move that, Matt. Oh my gosh. to Penumbra's first mission Penumbra's don't save blueprint bad that and then boom and what we're gonna do we're gonna just start putting in a bunch of meshes what we're gonna do actually is that we're gonna make the EM grid Height. 
So we're gonna go to grid. Highlight component. We're gonna make it a 50 by 50 grid. Make it huge. Then move that, and we're gonna move it over here. And this is gonna be a temporary grid, and what we're gonna do right now is that we need to make this. Bigger, bigger, bigger. Okay, that's big. That's a big, that's a big thing. It's huge, dude. So then what we need to do is that we also need to increase the nav mesh. Make that bigger. I gotta look over here. And grid. And then I gotta move in grid all the way over here. That works. And then this, we're gonna move you over here. And now, actually, EM grid. Hello, grid. I'm actually gonna make you much bigger. So, grid width. Make it, let's make it 75, and then 75, 75 that way. Okay. So what we're gonna be doing is that right now, I'm just gonna be putting in a bunch of no-go zones. Dun, 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 dun. Mesh, bow, this volume. Change this. What we're going to do is that we're just going to make a bunch of no goes. What we're going to do is I'm going to put these into a folder. 
map bounds. These map these no goes. So the what's unique about these no goes is that they are essentially map boundaries. They don't offer any cover. It's a bit weird, I know. No, 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 no all. I don't want to delete that. I gotta look over towards my left hand side right now because like I've been saying. So why are uh, E and cover? Let's open up the BP no go. Shape cube. can do I can go into like what the it's very broken Source controls at times. Oh, and you know what I gotta do? I gotta hold on before we go into this project settings. I'm gonna do Nanite. Nanite, it's enabled. Great. Cool. And uh, blueprints. I 
got to enable this. Uh, Windows platforms. Windows Shader Model 6. Okay. Save selected. Think writable. Okay, we're going to restart that so that we can crunch down the size of those assets. Mm. Mm. He. It is he, chat. He is my wallpaper. Um, yum, 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 yum. Okay, cool. And then, boom, boom. We're going to go into maps. And then we are going to go into... First mission, Penumbras. Cool. How does this look? I, I, I don't care. Camera should not be able to zoom out this much. That's a ticket. That's a quick fix. Later on. Oh, there we go. All right, cool. Game is not crashing, chat. Yay! The game is not crashing. Oh, yeah! Woohoo! So I'm just gonna. I know it looks like dog shit right now. We're gonna make a our own that and we're gonna go into blueprints M fog gradient
Oh my gosh, why am I so bad at Unreal Engine? White RGB code, Not what it's about to look like. Chat. Time to experiment around with this. Materials. We're experimenting around with materials. Your boy is not very familiar with materials. Oh boy! Boy, oh boy! Fucking sue you. Look at that. Calm down, Mickey. I will fucking calm down. I'm going to. I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, I, uh, Minnie left me. Minnie left me ever since I, uh, I got to real up to some real shenanigans back in 2020. We don't talk about 2020. for Disney trauma dumping Lamel. Good. I hope you enjoyed my trauma. It's good to talk about everything. Everything you need to talk about. Suddenly, my Mickey impression got really shitty.
What does that do? Okay. It's just white, you know. Now I have to move this over here. Oh wait, no. Attack him. gonna move him right over here is going on here. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. Time to move all these actors to their necessary spots. Gotta look over here and over here and over here and over here. Look over here and then over here. And then boom and boom. Save that. And 
boom, and then brrr. Let's play this, save this, boom. Gotta move up. Gonna make that one massive big actor. We're gonna move this over here. Do that. That should set up the no go zone. And then what we're gonna do here is that we're gonna go here and here and here. And then is that there? There we go. And then like we're gonna set this up and then boom. Totem is going to charge up. And then it's gonna be like, okay, we're, we're moving all the units up. Boom, 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 boom. Basic tutorial. Okay, we move everyone on up. Grace is a bit more cautious. And then boom. And then like, what are those? And then they, they're like, oh, look at that. Enemies, what are those things? And then... They're going to charge, and it's going to be combat. The totem is going to go on up. Go. Everyone's going to go on up. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. And then, like, oh, no, they come in. They're going to be... And then it's gonna be like, ding, 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 ding. it's gonna be an introduction to melee combat, and then ranged combat a bit, and then pew. let's get them. Let's get them. No, apparently they're just gonna sit there like the fucking idiots that they are. Pew.
I'm just gonna get into combat. I'm just gonna get into combat over there. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna add a shape. Deadass, I'm just gonna be at. Oop. Just gonna be adding a shape here. And then just elongating it. And then. I'm gonna open up the level blueprint. What I'm gonna do, I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna really hack together this solution. And then, boom, boom, and boom, boom. Break this link and then draw a debug sphere. That's not what I'm looking for. Okay, and boom, 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 and then go through there and like. Actor of class, and then
can just do this. Uh oh, we're about to get into all sorts of fuckery. There we go, fuckery achieved. The fuckery has been achieved, chat. That's a tea table. Now what we're gonna do is just get BP. Oh. table. Compile that. And let's test it. Oh, I should probably save this. Let's save this. And let's begin playing. Once again. Oh my god. Oh, it's fucking AI. Ugh. It missed. Oh my god. Oh my god. trying they're trying to get through chat but I'm but they're not they're not gonna get even close Trying, but they're not getting anywhere. It works for the time being. <laughs> it works. Sure. Attacking! Oh my gosh. 
Wait, hold on. Oh no, it doesn't work. Just fantastic. Am I right? Am I right or am I right, chat? Uh. I open up this banana. Banana, 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 banana. Banana time. These two pods, this pod number two, pod number two, die. There we go. Then what we're going to do. These guys, come on in. In the turn. I'm trying, I got so far, and I, 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 in the end, it doesn't even matter. It's so Jover, boys. No, it's not. Nah, 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 nah. Not at all. Look at that!
Did somebody say Joker? Oh, no. Nobody said Joker. I don't know fuck you. You made me say it. You made me say it. Uh, I said, oh, you know, I said, I said Jover. Can I just thank you? Yes, I can literally just puke you. Okay, there it is. Should not happen. That melee attack should not happen. I mean, not miss. characters over there. Book. My little notebook, my little notebook. Ah! Which one call it? Uh Ah yes. First. Let's get moving. Let's get moving. Let's get moving. Ah, oh, man. I don't know what to 
Что будет, говорит? Okay, I'm just kind of fucking around right now. This isn't interesting. This is not interesting. Okay, so. Uh, I don't know what to work on. Like, I'm genuinely just like, <clears throat> I don't know how to describe it. Like, what the fuck do I even work on here? Like, the AI is not working properly to even get the sight lines done. And I can't even work on the fucking sight lines because I don't know any of our project documentation because it was written by the senior programmer. Yeah. And then, and then EM Grid isn't working. Whenever I try to make it into a U function, it just doesn't work. And then I have to go research that. That's not, I'm sure that's very interesting for you, Chad. Uh, uh, I suppose we can. I suppose we can just work on the level blueprint. So like first pod killed. Event begin play variables enemies killed.
less than or equal to, let's just say four. Branch. If true. Characters TP Boolean So shit this link about this, move this up, and boom, 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 boom. Wait, no, that's not, that doesn't make any sense. Try to get this going. Misses, bring that in, and then 
boom, and boom, and then boom, boom. Uh, it's combat time. Today isn't a day! Oh my... Today isn't a day. It's not the best day. Lots of things are getting frustrating as I am pushing our very limited game to its limits right now. And it could be a lot better. All of this code, all of this, it needs to be fixed. It needs to be improved, and it needs to be optimized. And I can, you can always be saying that. Just, there's no documentation. There's barely, there's barely any documentation. There's no comments, function comments, descriptors, or anything of that matter. It is nothing but this shit just code upon code and it's not even like it's not even translatable into blueprints now it needs to be it needs to be translated into blueprints that's also another thing translated into blueprints because you know why because now we need to do this. And why the fuck is Carl Casey on this playlist? I tried to on this YouTube playlist. Ah, uh, I'm sorry, chat. I'm not. I'm, I'm sorry for bringing down the vibes. Today's just been kind of a tough day.
right, chat, I'm gonna take a quick break here. Like five minutes. I'll be right back. I'm back, chat. Uh, I am back. Told you I'd be back. Okay. Great architecture. Spelunky.
Okay. Trying to work on the architecture. R adjacent, can actor C, can actor C, can actor C, sell some vacant to draw sight lines. Find path towards actor, find path towards location. Get adjacent enemies. Let's see if I can even. the changes for that. Let's try this again. It's he, tis he. It's going to fail.
trying my best here, chat. It's not working. do I do? What do I do? Come on, work, work for me, please. Ah. Fucking T script interfaces. What the hell? Okay. Interfaces I have created in C++ and I've been added in my actor and I can determine that this actor implements my interface by my no pointer implements interface. However, if I want to assign my interface to some object property, I get void tscript cannot convert argument one from interface to u object. How can I store a reference to this interface for letter? see if property does not equal no pointer property then executes my interface method actor okay let's try this 
emgrid.cpp. I'm going to do remove actor. Remove act actor. IEM grid actor U interface static class Hold on. Okay, if actor get class implements interface, then Should actually get a cat. A cat. If actor get class implements interface u interface static class property the set interface cast inter. cell positions actor matrix set positions dot remove actor oh Maxwell <laughs> yeah that's a little thing I added I should get a real one I almost got a real one actually um, but then it was just like the time that it took to take care of the cat the time that I would need to take care of the cat combined with like other stuff and, uh, my working on this, I was just like, I don't think I can quite give the cat the attention and train, minimal training necessary to let it lead a good life. Excuse me. My girlfriend has cats now. Three of them. If actor get class implements interface u interface static class property dot set interface cast i uh, interface actor what does that say cast actor try can her not one it could be years and she can take care of it when <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> yeah yeah I, I think that's a little bit I think that's a couple of some issues get um, 
everything can be yours and she can take care of it when uh, it doesn't quite work like that when she lives an hour away. Executing two actions. What the, what the fuck? Unethical, maybe. Okay. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, it's compiling. Uh, I, yeah. I mean, it's also, also pretty cramped and like dumping re the responsibility of a cat onto somebody else is, yes, unethical. Okay. Patching remaining relocations. The live code ain't is a success but now we gotta go back into this my oh Okay. Class UEM grid actor public U interface generated body. So it has an interface. The grid actor has an interface. That's a T script interface, which then goes into the grid gen.cpp. But see, the thing is, is that we're passing an object that which has been put into the T script interface. And it's referencing the T script interface when it's not really referencing the direct object in the memory. It's just. Ah! Duh. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. Get her. UEM grid actor U interface. Dude, what the hell is going on here?
UEM grid actor, public U interface generated body. Class. Class IEM grid actor has no member implements interface. Oh. <laughs> bro, what the hell, bro? Static class get name return um oh my god bruh
grid actor. <gasps> it's the Far Owl dude. Hello. It is me, the Far Owl dude. How are you today? Is friendly, is enemy, is cover. I was going to join you early when I saw you were streaming, but my cousins were over, and but now I'm here. Well, regardless, thank you very much for being here. really appreciate it. Um, right now, I am slamming my head against a brick wall. Uh, because right now what I'm trying to do with this is that I just want to simply remove an actor for the time being when players get um, I need to remove on the grid a certain thing. Um, convinced my psycho cousins are psychopaths. Oh my god. They didn't know what waterboarding was, so I explained it to them. They then wanted to experience waterboarding. They then waterboarded each other. What the fuck? Yeah, I I think your cousins are pretty psychopathic. That's You sure they're good? He <laughs> They did not enjoy it, obviously. Yeah, I'd be very concerned if they actually did enjoy it. If they they did enjoy it, they got a place in Guantanamo Bay. Gosh, how old is that controversy? Not old, but scandal. No, they're not goid. Goid! By the way, after going through the deepest pits of random live streams and back, I got the answer to the wall running horse question. I saw that, yeah. Um... Here's a. I saw your answer. And what if I told you, what if the wall running horses and the humans could survive together? And like wall running horses become like intelligent beasts of burden, but also at the same time they like contribute to, um, what you call it, to the development. One stream had everyone saying we died, then they had a three hour convo on it, 
and named Wall Horses the Reckoning. They are now adding a wall running horsing. <laughs> Fucking have it like the, uh, the, uh, Cooper helmet. Also, I have come up with another question. Oh boy, all right. Okay, all right, Dev. Who wins in a horse fight? <laughs> a guy who wall runs or a wall that runs? I say wall. Um. like every single fight that has like this is like the equivalent of like the samurai versus knight discussion that like every historian i'm guilty of it i'm very guilty of having this discussion like every young historian has said he like said like this oh oh no the samurai <laughs> samurai wins no the knight wins and like and uh yeah and the historians are just, historians are kind of like, you know, it's just, it, it's just very contextual. It just depends on the battlefield and all that stuff. True and same. I think the wall is pretty obvious, but some say the guy who wall runs. Well, I mean, like, it, it literally depends on the circumstance. It depends on so many variables. No, the samurai. Oh, samurai are old. Um, they were made just after the Hei, the fall of the Heian dynasty. They because like with the with the power vacuum of the Heian dynasty. Um, that followed, a bunch of warlords rose up, and those were the OG samurai. And around that time, knights were also rising. And so, um, and knights very well extended into um, the, like, the institution that we know of it. Um, not what it is today, where it's kind of an honorific, but now the knighthood was also really starting to come into reality into being um towards yes samurai definitely used early guns because by the 1700s by the 1700s there was a sizable import of western weaponry into um japan but it wasn't like anything to a, a very effectively change a campaign. Um, because I, I, this is where my history knowledge gets really shoddy. But, uh, yeah, it wasn't really until the, the institution of the samurai so the samurai were once a actual like knight like an actual martial class but then they tra but then with the period of the the um under the Tokugawa shogunate and like the Edo period if I'm correct the the it then transformed into more of a more of a ceremonial class 
because there was no wars and uh, kind of came all bullshitty as reflected in like the quote unquote Bushido code. And then I, but there was still a extensive martial traditions that really didn't. And then with the Meiji restoration, um, that's when you saw, that's when you could, you could, um, it's like in Southern Japan, I forgot the specific region, but there was like one battle where there were actual samurai charging up against like modern 19th century, late 19th century weaponry. Like this is post civil war, American civil war. Um, yeah. And fun fact, I consider, I personally consider the American Civil War to be the first quote-unquote modern war because we have de we developed rifling. Because there were no wars. I know it said wars, but my reckoning infested brain <laughs> took a full second to realize you just, you didn't just say with no horse. Peter. The horse is here. Peter. Also, if you could do me a big, a big, a big favor and like this stream, I'd really appreciate that. If you're watching this in the VOD, make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you for making it this far. Uh, interesting. Yeah, but, um, but then, by the way, finish the concept art, thank you, finish the concept art for the four enemies in the world, the world one of my games, fuck yeah, dude, got some concept art, now let's just make them blocks, let's make them blocks, block time. Thank you very much for liking that stream, for, for liking the stream. What happens if I... Sadly, my brother has my computer and he's in America, so got until 2nd of February so I can finally start code and art assets and stuff. Ooh. Okay. So you've just been doodling on like your tablet or your phone? Fun, nice. Well, that's impressive. That's impressive, dude. Uh, better than mouse for sure. Oh yeah, that haptic, that haptic layer, definitely works out. Well, not mouse. Oh, you mean drawing pad, trackpad? Yeah. Oh, trackpad! Holy shit, dude. <laughs> you know what? I don't know if you have a birthday coming up soon, but like, you know what would be a great gift? Get in like your first walk -em. 
self. It's a reference to self. Uh, That's a map. No, the trackpad is like the, uh, like, uh, it, it allows you to manipulate your mouse all with like your finger and like, yeah, but like a drawing pad here, let me show you a drawing pad with like an actual stylus and all that stuff. Something like this. It's on stylus and all that stuff. Oh, my birthday was on the 6th. I got an Xbox and some chocolates for my little sister. Wow. That's cute. Nice. Okay. Ah, damn. Oh, this is a fucking BP no go. No wonder why it's like, what the hell, bro? <laughs> so. <laughs> Such a great gift, but then I guess there is the Xbox. <laughs> what abs? <laughs> what abs, dude? Uh, let me adjust my camera a bit. Take actions. Uh, yeah. What do you mean as EM grid? EM. No, I don't want that class. Oh man. I'm trying to figure this out. Also, new vid just dropped. It's on our shorts. New short just dropped. Fire Hell Studios. Let's go to Fire Hell Studios. Oh my God. Uh, new vid just dropped. Ugh. Cast to EM Grid. Uh, by the way, would you mind? giving me your opinion on the concept art if not that's fine um uh, yeah no i'd be happy to give you uh, my opinion is there any uh just drop the files I'll, I'll take a look at them in photoshop son of a bitch this is actually why I have my drawing pad. Hold on. Unplug. Yep, this works.
Uh, yeah. E email them? Yeah. Feel free to email it to me. I'll break out my drawing pad and all of that stuff. Oh my lord, my cousins are arguing in the group chat. 50 notifications. Oh my gosh, I am sorry for you. That is very unfortunate. Like checking out my spam at times. Sorry, I'm looking over at my email right now. I'm waiting for art devs images to come on in. I'll come on in when I want to be on it. This needs to be converted into a blueprint. This is something that we will definitely be toying with as level designers. It also makes our lives easier to manipulate. Okay.
EM grid. I sent you it. All right, let's see. Flip around. Okay, so I can just. Okay. I'm gonna close Discord here. So I know I spent too long writing small. Just in case, I'm not gonna even actually take a look at those right now. I. up for you. Make sure that my curse. Okay. I'm gonna take a look at this guy. Wait, concept art. Oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, I'm just gonna take some blind look at this. Penumbra's concept art was leaked. Oh no. Okay. Let's see. Let's take a look at this. I'm looking at this as a gameplay designer. So these look like basic enemies. Motherfucker. My Unreal just crashed in the background. Um, so those guys look like basic enemies. Basic tutorial enemy. I remember you talking to me about that. It's like how the Hollow Knight bugs are. Okay. Cool, cool, they skitter across. Skittering, I see. I see some opportunity for character flair. And then let's see. Yeah. Let's see. They are a circle like that. And then, like, I can, like, jump onto them and then hop off them. And then it's a pretty basic design, okay. Let's see about this. These are drones, okay, I can see that.
Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't quite know. Don't so the issue is is that one of the things I'm trying to look at is like okay what can the player immediately ascertain from the designs I'm gonna be honest I mean this like this could be good like okay that's the point that you need to go for you need to focus on this and this that's good um, that's the part that you need to kill as for the rest of it, uh, that would probably f flecked off. And then, okay. Um, I remember you going for a machine horror. I, I think that's a great, I think it's a good first start. Uh, I remember you having wall running. And I think you have like the idea and all that stuff. I wouldn't get too invested into these guys because ultimately you're going to be changing them. You're going to have to kill your children. My streams mention a lot of killing the children. I'm so strange. Ugh. No, these are all good. These are all looking pretty good, if I say so myself. Ugh. All right. Pretty good jerky. Drown them in a river. Oh, no. How tragic. Uh, yeah, I don't quite have time for them right now on the stream. I gotta keep on working on this. Testing out this logic. I'll take a look at them later.
What I am working on right now is manipulating the grid and grid architecture. And it crashed. Great. While eating, while eating beef jerky, which I got for Christmas. Got to compile really quick. By the way, have you considered streaming on Twitch as well? Yeah, um, I was looking at dual streaming. I was looking at dual streaming so uh, products that allow me to stream to Twitch and YouTube at the same time. Annoyances ads are pretty common. Yeah. On your end. Uh, I don't even know how I would begin doing those ads.
what is the What's the shock and revelation, dude? Did YouTube delete the message? I guess. What'd you say? You're a foodie? Yes. Sort of am. <laughs> yes, it did. It did send. I am slightly a furry, yes. I like to look at the art and not the weird art that that is probably immediately coming to your mind. The reason, um, uh, so, <clears throat> excuse me. Yeah. So funnily enough, there's a lot of, uh, Gosh, how do I navigate this? Fuck it. There's a lot of safe for work, really good safe for work furry art. Like, let me pull up some. I, I follow, I follow a lot of like, um, what should I call it? Yeah. Thank you. Um. So this is like some of the art that I really like. This is from an artist called Drawing Sophia Sofa. Wait, hold on. Yeah, Drawing Sofa. Um, it's art that's like this. I really like looking at art like this. What I just said went way over your head. No, it did not. I I had to. I know what you're saying. I appreciate it, but I still want to show off this art. This is like some really cool art. Um, I, I, it, it's super interesting how, like, I've just observed that slobs, like, if you look at between, like, people in, like, Western Europe and, like, Western European countries and, like, the type of furry art that they make compared to, like, slob it, slobs, like, I know there's a lot of, I, I, I know it's like a generalization, but what I've been observing is that a lot of like Slavic people make furry art like this, and it's just like, what? Um, it, it's remarkably good. Poles, Ukrainians, Russians, Finnish. Um, This, uh, but I know this isn't the art you really like most of the time. Stop busting my balls! Uh, the art reminds me of Lackadaisy. Yeah. Oh man, Lackadaisy. It's a shame. Uh, honestly, congrats. Uh, huge congratulations to Lackadaisy for their insane success they've been enjoying over the. 
um, enjoying. But if we go to like a daisy. Yeah, if we go to, um, whatchamacallit? If we go to, like, the most recent Lackadaisy comics, like, holy shit! <laughs> Spoilers, by the way. Like, oh my gosh! This is in copyright 2020, and Tracy's just been, has been working on this comic whenever she can, but it's just... Look at the art style on this. Mordecai, I forgot his name. And then, but if you look at this, and then if you like go back to like Lackadaisy Spaghetti, like look at the change in the art style. Obviously, this has been pilot for the animation. Yeah. Damn, I know, right? It, it, it's a genuine shame that Tracy isn't... I don't, like, see any progress of her working on this, which makes total sense. Like, I don't blame her. Like, a show is definitely a, reaches a lot more people nowadays. And, like, considering, like... All the coverage on Lackadaisy, all the actors and the high high level cast and all that stuff. It, it Lackadaisy is essentially a part of the two D Renaissance that we are going to be enjoying within the next within probably the next year or so. Like three D animation, like it's kind of going, whereas like two D animation is going, it's going up. But still, I wish she worked on this. It's been three years. It's almost four years. But Kickstarter month has been exhausting chaos. Yeah, in a good way. Yeah. So she's been working on Kickstarter. This is like the last page. Kickstarter chaos. <laughs> yep. Kudos to Tracy. Just the fucking... Oh my gosh. It's so good. Oh, the lighting detail on Mordecai's glasses. It's so good. I'm sorry. I watched the pilot after I started really enjoying YouTube indie animations, but it's probably not my favorite animation, cause maybe because it's only a pilot right now. Yeah. I don't know how faithful the pilot's gonna remain to the comics, but if it does, oh brother, are you in for a hell of a ride that is if they remain faithful they could go like a completely different direction like there are several um the pilot places all the pilot is weird like obviously it's a pitch piece a pitch piece for the universe that tracy has built the 1920s um st louis Um, St. Louis, and it's just meant to show off the world. But story-wise, it's kind of weird. I'm a lackadaisy enjoyer and connoisseur. No. Um, yeah. I, I just... Yeah. Okay. At first, it was just hell of a boss because it randomly took over my front, you, front page one day. Then... Oh. And then... They did... The Digital Amazing Circus, because the same happened, but on a lesser degree. Then Murder Drones, because I like Tadsy, and then I finally watched Lackadaisy. Yeah. It's almost like shows with the soul behind them. That are unique, engaging, and fun, and are not just corporate shills, shillings.
Ah, uh, yes. Lackadaisy connoisseur. I listen to Olive Branch. A hell of a lot. My opinion, Lack of Daisy was great, but the other ones were a bit better. Um, it might just barely be better than Murder Drones, though. Um, yeah, I honestly enjoyed Lack Daisy a whole lot more. But that, I mean, that's your opinion. Your opinion, and you're wrong. No. Um. Murder Drones felt a bit weird, and the story literally gave me a stroke trying to understand what the hell I just watched after each episode. Are you talking like a good stroke or a bad stroke? Is it like, oh my gosh, my brain is getting fucked in so many good ways? Or is it like, oh my gosh, I'm my brain is getting fucked in so many bad ways? Is it like hell of a boss pilot writing? Or is it... Or is it like good, like, what the hell did I just watch? Bad? Okay. That's unfortunate. Yeah, that, that sometimes happens. I had no idea what was happening. That's fair. I... I'm gonna be honest, I don't know. what to say. Less with, what the hell did I watch? More, what the hell's going on? Who are you? Who's the? Who's other letter? When do sentinels, when did sentinels appear? Russian girl man. The fuck going on in chat? GLaDOS was so confusing, never knew what was happening with them. Huh. I'm s- I was- I'm s I'm still so- Even after watching a story from Explanation, I'm still confused. I don't know what to say, dude. Uh, we're talking about indie- indie animation. Uh, art devs currently wa ranting about, um, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that pretty much like, sums up. He mentioned he's a furry, and then we started going on about like a daisy. Yep. Oh boy, whenever people are just gonna hear like, oh, he's a furry, they're just. Gonna, I, I I hope they don't jump to the worst. Yeah, just enjoy the art. Not that kind of art. Fuck. I'm a fucking casual, okay? Just a confusing one. That's fair. It's it's definitely fun to watch, but just confusing. That that, that makes sense. That's the hell of a boss syndrome. Pilot was fun to watch. 
Uh, pilot was fun to watch, but man, did it. What are you, huh? Uh, I just like. I like safe for work art! Ew, no. What the hell, dude? No. Uh, uh, I'm like fucking Mort right now. Fucking like more. Uh, hold on. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like this gift. Uh, <laughs> fucking Madagascar. Uh. <laughs> Bro, the fuck? Uh. What do you mean, the fuck? from the hit film, 2006 film. When was that film released? Madagascar. <laughs> Madagascar movie, I have to see when this was released. Madagascar 2005, I'm sorry, that was a year off. The hit 2005 film, Madagascar. <laughs> With more crying. <laughs> I fucking love this. <laughs> I fucking love these. The Mort crying. Gift. I gotta find this. Mort crying. <laughs> this one. The look right. Look. <laughs> look right. Look up. Look right. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sending this gif. I love this gif. Uh. Uh, test bot flag, why are you spawning enemies? Yo, my mate. Oh, fucking sorry, car genius. Sorry, car chanting. Oh, boom, boom. I can't believe you, Ege, uh, assumed that was the art. I'm, I just meant you like cat furry art instead of dark dog art, right? SMH. Shaking. Shaking my head. SMH my head. <laughs> ah. 
Okay. I've opened up a floodgate. <laughs> Haven't I? I imagine I have. Bro, my art with emojis didn't show up. Uh, what were you trying to make, Black? Or Edge? Sorry. I just referred to you by your Discord name. <clears throat> Excuse me. Got to go. I'll be back. All right. See you around, Art. Is indeed historical. The floodgates have opened. I was trying to do a historical event. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What historical event were you trying to do, Edge? I hope I can have it in my chat. America related. Do you have any idea how much that narrows it down? Let me try again. Okay. Generated body UE5. Oh, 
boy, the link is provided by... Okay. We're trying, chat. So this is a macro. Send them one by one. <laughs> okay. Probably you may get flagged for spamming. But sure. Uh, Ethereum Metropolis API. I am grid actor generated body public virtual pool is friendly as enemy. Enemy. Oh, yep, yep. I'm going to stop you there. I see plane. Yep. All right. All right. You're going to go into timeout. You're going to go in timeout for five minutes. You've been, you've pushed the line multiple times, and just, you pushed the line and you've crossed over it this time around with that joke. You're being needlessly edgy. There is no purpose in your edge other than to be edgy. And so, yeah. Shock humor has its place, which is putting, throwing out and out of the blue. It is not necessary. Do that again, and I will do that again, and I, and I will ban you from the chat. Menth, what's up? I'm glad to have you here today. How's your holidays been? How have your holidays? How do I English? How do I grammar? Anyways, how have the holidays been treating you? I'm a potato. Well, as Sim would say, potato, boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew, boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. you I am today hasn't been the best day so far um, I've been trying to work on this this grid architecture and and to essentially 
tell about it. I've kind of hit a roadblock. I need to investigate this further, and it's not very interesting on stream stream content wise. So I've just but essentially what happens is that the app the grid actor is now an interface and I have to translate that from an interface into an object or reconvert this from an ob interface into an object so that I can effectively communicate with all of that stuff. But see, the thing is, if I translate that into an object, then that become, then I need to distinguish between a, a, like, a, 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 a being, like a, a player character or an enemy, and cover. And so then, yeah. So, uh... Yeah, and I've been banging my head pretty much all stream today, just trying to figure out how exactly I can even start going about this. And, like, also kind of rambling on about, like, how we don't have any documentation. But also chatting here with chat. Ugh. Mm -mm -mm. So, yeah. Earlier we were talking about indie animation. Are you familiar about indie anim any indie animations? Who is the second guy? Uh, that's Edge. Edge or Ege. depends on who's who's at the helm today. At today. Zell seems vacant. Draw sight lines. Nemesis Blue. That sounds like a Citadel. It sounds like a miniature paint color. Sorry, man, it won't happen again. Yeah, that's fine. Like, uh, um,. Yeah, if you're gonna do if you're gonna do shock humor, at least do it well. Um, you can't just throw around, haha, <laughs> edgy shock. Rather unexpectedly, but yeah. Going back, uh, it, the Nemesis Blue. It literally does sound like something. The paint color. If cell seems vacant, no man, Nemesis Blue is a horror story for Team Fortress Two. Huh? Did you watch it? Oh, oh my gosh! Nemesis Blue. Oh, I seen. I saw the thumbnail for it on my you uh, on my feed on my YouTube feed. But no, I have not watched it. Maybe I'll watch that with my girlfriend. She really likes horror. <laughs> Find path. It was awesome. A M Grid Tick at Actor. It's like two hours great storytelling from the animation. It's worth it. Okay, I'll definitely add it to my horror. I'll definitely add it to my horror list. Second, the U interface class is not the actual. 
reflection system. The actual interface that will be inherited by other classes must have the same class name in the initial U. Instead of an I. C++ only interface functions. You can declare a virtual C++ function in your interface header file. To make a blueprint callable interface function, you must provide a U function macro, macro in the functions declaration with the blueprint callable specifier. You must I, also use either the blueprint implementable event or blueprint native event specifiers and the function must not be virtual interesting kai is that your real name the one or the one above your head yes kai is my real name but i just like to call myself kai lulu A M grid. U function blueprint callable blueprint implementable event category equals trigger reaction bool react to trigger public blueprint. Uh, Reading the fucking documentation gives me my the answers that I need. <gasps> what? No, no way! My gosh! What the code is that? That is four oh six. What? As fire. Ba, 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 ba. All right. Okay. Cool. Let's get to work. Let's get down to. Can I tell you a random game dialogue? Yeah, sure. Okay. Pardon me equals which game? Pardon me equals which game? It's hmm. a good question. Sure, I'll take a hint. <clears throat>
It is the spy, the spy from Team Fortress 2. Oh, 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 oh. oh, well, I guess I will just fuck myself. That's that that build's gonna fail. What's going on here? So I have a... Guess then this... Guess this, then it's easy. Okay. What do we got? heavy. Yeah, it's heavy. Oh, I, I said it, it, it. It's heavy weapons guy. Track. Dude, I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing.
implement override specific to that class. Dude. I have no idea what to do. Do I like comics? Well, somewhat do, yeah. Not really into the mainline comics, more into web comics. Because your boy's grown up on the internet. No function. I have no idea. I need to learn. I have a I have an original Teenage Mutant Ninja Mutant Neutrinos comic. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I'm gonna be honest. I really don't have any idea what that means. <laughs> Uh, yes, I do. I do know Bloodborne. It is one of my most favorite games. Did you read the comics? No, I did not even know there were comics for Bloodborne. Yeah, there's like three and I own all three of them. Oh, nice. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> We're at the 420 mark. The live stream.
I don't know what to do right now. Just kind of sitting here, kind of just fucking around the game. I'm like genuinely burnt out right now. I need to like take a break. Keep pushing on, keep pushing on. Honestly, I think I'm going to be ending the stream here today. I mean, we didn't really get much done, unfortunately. And, uh, yeah, uh, it's just one of those days. Uh, I mean, I don't know what to do. I need to look at this further. It is unfortunate, but it is the way that things go. So, with that, Edge and anyone else in here, thank you all very much for coming on by. If you all are interested in swinging by the Discord, feel free to hop on in here to our Discord channel. Excuse me. Uh, and... Feel free to chat in there. Um, anyways, everyone, it was very lovely. And uh, I will be live streaming tomorrow. Most I could be live streaming on Monday. I will let everyone know by probably Saturday evening or Sunday evening. Just depends on my New Year's plans. Alrighty. Take care, everyone, and thanks for a great live stream today. <laughs>